we deserve the brewski after that. I'll just write them off. <laughs> I just wrote it on my Facebook. I said, oh, shopping, I said, food shopping's done. Nine hours later. Yes, Hudson. Um, probably on the table. Thanks, love. Cheers. Yeah, we just got home from shopping. And we got some pizza. And oh my god. This is. Two hours ago we got this. <laughs> Three twenty I think our order was ready. No. So good, eh? What do you give it out of ten? Oh my god. I do get into the car with you. Ten, I know. Hang on, I'm kind of looking sick. Um we took this back to City Farmers too. And they replaced it because the other one. I think I said before. First one we got the two ducks out of them and then that one blue says it was plugged in. And where was the box? I thought someone picked it up. <laughs> this is the aftermath of um, Cyclone Lucy the and the Cyclone pump. Diesel. The hell, what are you been doing? Oh, oh, oh. Who did all this? Who did all this mess? What's all this? Who did it? Hmm? Look at her. She can look more guilty if she tried. Look at her. Who did it? Who did, who did this mess? Was it you, Lucy? And my husband and... I will like drive because he helped at the end. I'm going to just put my... <laughs> uh, what, what clotheslines do they call those again, love? Heels toys. Heels toys. <laughs> <laughs> Look at her thing on her back. Gandos. Get him. <laughs> this is what my shopping looks like. Before I unpack it all nicely. Take a photo. <laughs> Plus all the stuff that's in the esky. That needs to come out like ASAP, so. Scott, can you grab that out for him when it finishes, please? Yeah. Okay, so we got some of these pork loin steaks. I thought they looked pretty good in there. They got 10 bucks there. Yeah, so they're $20 a kilo, but yeah, the pack's only 10, so. I thought they looked pretty good. So we got some of those. I don't need to chuck them straight in my freezer. Um, oh, these are mushy. Oh, well. Uh, stir fried veggies from Aldi. Got a tub of margarine from Aldi. A couple of chooks for roasting. And using for lunches and stuff, no doubt. Uh, I like, don't mind the old chicken roast. Roast chicken. A uh, big thing of juice again. Everyone loves that. Um, we got this steak from Woolies with some scotch fillets. And I got some chicken that is going to fridge for separating. Um, yeah, just chicken, chicken breast. We got some ice creams, vanilla. We got some chicken wings from Woolworths as well. These, uh, yeah, nearly two kilos. I'll show you the marinade we got. Those, um, yeah, when I show you the grocery stuff. And these, oh my god, these were from Aldi, and I think last time I bought them, I wasn't sure where I bought them from in the end. Um, yeah, I actually thought it might, may have been, might have been worse, but yeah. Yeah, chicken, feta and parsley gourmet sausages, oh my god, so good. I think they're about seven bucks for a pack, so six in one, so not too bad. And we got a big pack of rump steak, so there's just over a kilo there. And that looks really nice. Yeah, I haven't been buying a mistake or anything from Aldi, I just don't like it at all. And we got some chicken burgers. We got a block of parmesan. 
another silver side. I bought, I had one in the freezer and I cooked, only cooked it yesterday. It's just beautiful. Um, and we got some of these chunky beef pies. I bought a family pie in one of my vlogs. Uh, beef one that was marked down and it was so good. So we saw them. We thought we'd get a couple of packets of them. And I got these from Woolly, so carrot, colourful out and broccoli, big filler bag, some peas, some corn cobs, got some woolies as well. Oh, and I got I love this bag as well. Been watching the vlogs forever. Spring greens mix, so good. That's it for that. And that's just some choppy. We bought a big block of chocolate in a while today. Okay, I'm not gonna unpack it like I normally do. I'm literally gonna pull the stuff out of the bags and show you what I got as I do that, because <sighs> it's been a long day. So, mm. let's do that. Okay, so in this first bag, we have a bag of baby spinach and rocket. And I've got some baby cost lettuce. These were only $2 for a two pack and they looked really good. And I just thought that they would stay fresh in the fridge for quite a while. So I've got two of those instead of the you know, old normal lettuce that I always get. And yeah, they've got to be just so beautiful and fresh. I'm gonna make some. Something for lunch with that tomorrow, I reckon. And well, these are just the bananas we got from Woolworths. And what have we got in this one? This is from Aldi. So we've got a uh, banana bread mix. And we've got two carrot cake mixes as well. And I've got a few of the brownies, chop, triple chocolate fudge brownies as well. They were like cheap. They were like $2, I want to say $2.30 a pack. And I told Joy, you know, tip of the tip of the bag, right? I told Joy to grab like five to seven popcorn. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine. That's nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh God, I don't even know if I counted that right this time. Oh, so random. Ah, uh, bag of bike up soda. Yeah, it's real weird going shopping with like, the kids and that. It's just like. I don't know, I just felt like I forgot to buy a lot of stuff. Um, the strawberries were only $2 a punnet this week, so that was, yeah, I was quite happy to see that. So I grabbed four boxes, or four boxes, oh, sure. four um, punnets rather, and I think that one might have been yours. 
And what we got? Yeah, he was James was gonna grab shapes. I so get these. These were uh, dollar fifty. They're really good. I like the balsamic ones. Uh, I got some more cappuccinos. God, my sugar's back from open. <gasps> yeah, big two kilo bag of sugar. I'm gonna go put it straight in the jar. Ancient herb ones, oh, squash buns. <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god, Squash bread is my pet hate. Oh my god. Oh, so annoying. Yeah, someone's getting stabbed with a spoon, that's it. Have you seen my bread rolls? <laughs> I put them in the crate. They look like roadkill. <laughs> Is it because I live in the bush I get to have roadkill <laughs> buns now? <laughs> well, you wanted them smaller. Oh. <laughs> That'll still be all right. I can get my pump, up, pump out. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, that's all right, that one. That one's alright. Who are you lying to? One out of no, that one, one there. Well, one out of a 12 pack. Look, we got one, two, three, four out of a 12 pack. So <laughs> dumb. And I got some vegetable oil. Um, I'd probably just use that when I do a bit of flat frying or whatever. Got another loaf of my beautiful bread that I love from Aldi. And this one is. All loaves of not squash bread. Beautiful. Look at that. Ooh, I'm gonna make a space right back there. Beautiful. Yeah, Audi's changed their bread, and um, yeah, I wasn't sure what I thought of it at first. One loaf I did get though was very small, so that was a bit weird. Um, I'd say those two are both. No, it's not. This is a red one though.
Yeah, we hadn't bought hash browns for ages either, so it'd be nice to have those in the freezer again. Um, four kilo bag of spuds as well. Just trying to make room on that table without crossing the buns anymore. This might be so yay. Um, okay, what do we got? Aldi bag. So, some more of that beautiful pasta. This one's just the macaroni cheese. Got two little one kilo bags of plain flour. Like I said to you before, I always like to have this because if I've got tomato paste, I've got pizzas because anything can go on those. Um, what have we got? More popcorn, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Oh, we've got 15 <laughs> popcorn. Oh my god. Um, uh, oysters, damn, I didn't mean to buy them. I did buy them the other week, but I was thinking I was buying um, sardines. So it's going to be interesting when I find the rest. I think I might have bought all those. I uh, got some bicarb and a couple of tins of diced, well, not even diced, pineapple slices in juice. These are cheap too, these are like 99 cents. And I got a couple of aiolis. So this one is just the traditional creamy aioli. And this one is garlic lovers, which I haven't seen before, so I think that'll be really good. My eggs and um, spinach, spinach, avocado, spinach, and then your poached egg, and then oh, some, what do you call it? Nutritional yeast and the hemp seeds over it. Oh my god, and aioli, it's all pepper, so good. Okay, red kidney beans, light coconut milk, we got two of them, and we got two packs of the pink lady apples. And yeah, there wasn't even any to pick out, like really just put in your own bag, there's like one, one left, so I wasn't going to bother with that. Um, what are you going this one? Alrighty, so I've got another bag of Spit and Rocket. I've got my palette of blueberries. Yum. I've got a bag of tomatoes. These were six fifty. There was um, tomatoes that you could pick yourself, but they they didn't they weren't bright colour wise, but they were sort of soft. So I was like, yeah, no. Leave that there, thanks. Uh, I've got some red capskins. These ones look look alright. Um, but there wasn't that many to choose from and they were sort of mediocre. A couple of zucchinis as well. Always like to do a zucchini slice with all the eggs that we have around. Okay, I'm going to have to go around that one's tired for some reason. Alright, this is a Woolworths bag. So I've got a, bag of, uh, a little bag of rosemary spice stuff. We've got some honey soy chicken. We've got uh, sour cream and onion Pringles and two boxes of muesli bars. So this one is chewy chop chip, chewy forest fruits and chewy apricot and these ones are just yogurt strawberry flavour. Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't pick those ones, weird. Uh, I've got some plain papadums. I've got four protein bars for myself. These are the Quest ones. These are really good. 21 grams of protein in these, only one gram of sugar, and there's 14 grams of fiber. So, really good, and 202 calories. So, I don't, I don't eat them all the time, but it's good to have something in there for a little treat. And another box of cappuccinos. I'm just gonna bought more Papa Dons. And these ones are Papa Dons, but they're the cumin flavor. They're really good as well. Uh, we've got a few sauces in here. So I've got this Italian dressing. This was marked down on clearance and I checked the date and it's good till uh, March 2021. Just gonna marinate me some chicken in that. That'd be nice. And then we've got half some soap. This just smells. Oh, 
so beautiful. Really, really good. Milk and honey extract, it's beautiful. And this is the marinade that hubby saw, that he was like, wanting to get something to marinade, so we're like, go the chicken wings. And here's my other baked beans that I was saying before. Uh, I'll grab some more soy sauce too. This one is always really beautiful. I did a recipe the other week and I used one that I had to get from down the road because I had none. And it was horrible. So, oh, oh my gosh, that one smells so good. Really beautiful. And I needed some more apple cider vinegar. So it's got the corn mills one. And we've got some more soap. That's more soap, just in case we run out. Um, shaving gel, foam, whatever. Half price, so that was cool. And I just got this. This wasn't even on a special. I love, love, love this marinade. Actually, I'm going to marinate that chicken. I'll just put in the fridge with that. Yeah. And what have we got left? Oh, and I bought some more golden syrup too. I've always got oats and that, so it's always good to be able to make those biscuits. Um, here I have a carton of full cream milk, and underneath I've got two six packs of the like long life flavoured milks, the strawberries, the new milks. Um, I've got yeah two, two of the strawberries and two of the chocolates in there, so that's what's in that one. This bag here has more wraps. Sorry guys, I'm not trying to get stuff out of that. So this one has more wraps in there. So these ones are just the original, and these ones are the light ones. So I don't know what the difference is gonna be with these. I'll have to check out the stats and see what, what it reckons. And they had these little mini chocolate croissants. They were on clearance for $2.76. So we got two of those. Love that, and these I own my mate. And I need to them. So they go back to there. Okay, and I just found another cold bag. Let's get it done quick so I can get it away. I might just take it out there. Oh. Yeah, I'll do that. Okay, so I've got two packs of Plony here, or Devon as they already call it. A couple of blocks of Philadelphia cheese. Hash browns and packet of chips, and I got a box of fish fingers too. They were pretty cheap, and I thought the kids might like them. Something different, dinner. Um, just got one block of cheese. I've still got pretty much a whole block in the fridge, so didn't need too much of that. Got two one kilo vanilla yogurts. Oh, more mushy stir fry veggies, <laughs> and got another. Big pack of this bacon, it's only like 10 bucks a kilo, it's really good. Let's go another bake old bag. So I've got three, three litres of milk. They were marked down, so I was to grab them. I've got two light sour creams in here, a bag of chips and a 600 ml thickened cream as well. Get that in the fridge quickly as well. Okay, I unpacked the bags at the back because they were tied up. My husband ties the bags, it drives me. Oh, bloody undorm, that's why. But yeah, at least we didn't lose anything. <laughs> um, but there was two packets of beef noodles in there. So there's five in each, like two minute noodles. And we got the chicken ones over here. A couple of fly sprays at the back there. And some more dishwashing liquid, some vinegar. I've been loving my poached eggs with vinegar in the morning, right? Just, oh God. I reckon I've been eating them for like two weeks, pretty much every day in the morning, so good. I uh, got some more of the black beans that are only 75 cents and some more bread, another four loaves. And I ended up getting a couple of tins of this tuna. It was like a dollar something for a can, which I thought was really cheap. So give that a go. Got two of them, a couple of tomato paste, like I said, good for pizzas. Corn kernels, big box of each grain. It was um, half price in Woolies, four dollars something off the top of my head. And we also got our skim milk from We'll work this week as well. So we've got 12 of them. Uh, we've got three cans of kidney beans. And we've just got some toothpaste. And luckily here's my sardines. Um, James did get my flavour that I love. 
So that's cool. And we got some cornflakes. And this is the bag of Naughties that we bought for the drive up there. So we've got a big bag of booties. These are on Fresh Shop IGA. We've got some chicken twisties. Some fizz. They're like whiz fizz. Whiz fizz? Oh. Fizz. I can't remember the gold now. But they're cheap and they're keeps in the bag. We've got some frogs alive. All the Allen's all is on special. Got some chicos. And from um, Chemist Warehouse. We went there. It's got some liners. I've got this for Scar for Christmas. It's got a lip liner. I don't know what the other thing is. But yeah, like lip gloss and that. You know. Christmas fire. Um, and we got some magnesium tablets. So these ones are for my husband. We've got a script in there that's for my friend and her magnesium as well. And I've got myself a couple of nail polishes that I thought were really pretty colours. So nail cheap. I haven't bought anything like that for ages. I was only wanting to pump my nails yesterday. I uh, got some more hemp kids that I was saying I love on my eggs. And I got some of these scouts I was asking for them and they were like $1.89. So I looked for some of them. She can have, have some of those on some things that she eats. I think she'll really like that. I also got a 24 can carton of Coke. Two for my husband for work for during the week. Okay, I've just worked out what I've spent. So my Audi and Woolies and my stuff that I bought from IGA came to $738.17. And including Scarlet Shoes and Domino's for lunch and, well, and the chemist stuff. No, because I had $8.94 for the shoes and the chemist, so another 50 on top of that. Nine, ten, one, two, three, four. So 940 dollars altogether, and that's not even including the fuel that we spent <laughs> going up in Hubby's car. So, I'm well, absolutely knackered. I'm gonna go and chill out with my husband and watch some TV. Thanks for watching my big fortnightly grocery haul. I hope you liked it. Give it a thumbs up if you did and I'll see you in my next vlog. Bye.